the different elements of the Mew come together to support each other. Each different component of the Mew brings together a different kind of element of a warfighting capability uh, that ends up supporting each other. So the BLT uh, and their Marines, and then the ACE provide, uh, provide support to them uh, with our aircraft uh, in the form of transportation. And then the logistics combat element uh, is there from, in the form of the uh, CLB in order to help uh, sustain those forces and ensure they get the uh, support that they need. At the beginning, we had a very young platoon, uh, but in the Marine Corps, we're a reps-based business. So as time went on, as we progressed our going through the deployment program, they actually started showing more proficiency, got way more comfortable with it. Everything about the Mew is we're prepared for anything. So there's so many different contingencies, so many different options that they could you know, deploy us to. Uh, so we need to be really on top of our game and have a wide spectrum of capabilities. Every deployment is different, I would say. Every deployment is different, but the, the mission never changes. We become a, a one team, one fight. We all have the same goal, same mission. And uh, it's always to make sure that we go, we go on deployment as one team and come back as one team and make sure we, don't, we leave nobody behind. This MAGTAF is, is ready, we're certified, we're trained. What we've put together is a team that I believe is uh, absolutely ready for whatever might come our way as we go forward. This MAGTAF is built on an incredible number of world-class Marines and sailors. They've committed themselves to a level of excellence, readiness, and teamwork that has made them absolutely the premier force in readiness as a Marine Air Ground Task Force, but also as a critical part of the Naval Expeditionary Force with the Amphibious Ready Group 